There's two types of men in this world. Mm. Ones that are naturally skilled at romance, yes. aka the Rolandos of the world. <laughs> oh, jeez. And then there's the rest of us uh, who have to watch YouTube tutorials on how to do over the clothes stuff. Ah, oh, okay. <laughs> okay, so right hand no. on here no. and rotate counterclockwise no. until oh, pleasure it's... achieved. <laughs> Not that I don't extreme, know. Dude. I'm kind of getting hot. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, today's listener Not falls. Counterclockwise. They fall into that second category because his attempt at a grand romantic gesture backfired so badly, he spent the last few days desperately trying to correct it. Oh. Which only made it worse oh, no, To the no. point he's willing to ask us For romantic advice oh, God. You're going to hear what happened In your brand new awkward Tuesday phone call <laughs> Right after we do some counterclockwise action oh, That's right. coming up next It's awkward It's Tuesday It's awkward Tuesday phone call Getting engaged is one of the most exciting moments of your entire life. Oh my gosh, Aww. it really is. You're it's so fun. You're filled with happiness and <laughs> hope and optimism. And Brooke, you've been there. Oh, it's how, so good. How long did the joy last before the harsh <laughs> reality of marriage finally <laughs> set in? Was it like a month? Two no, months? I, I think marriage is great. I really do. Brooke's in denial. So <laughs> one of our listeners just got engaged and says that joyful feeling lasted less than one minute, oh, which what? is what why heck? he needs our oh. help today. His name is JK. So mm. welcome to the show, JK. And I'm not joking when I welcome you. I do mean welcome. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Thank you. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I'm like, all the time. Yeah, yeah that's, like, that's good, good joke, radio man. Well, it's, that's a tough name to have normally. Yeah. So tell us, you got engaged recently. I want to say congratulations, but why did the joyful feeling last so short? Yeah. Uh, okay, so I've been dating Leanna for two years. Aw. Yeah, it's nice. I, I love her. And a lot. she's the one you ended up getting engaged to, I'm assuming, <laughs> right? Yes. It's actually a valid question for this show. If you're already feeling the regret, who knows? Yeah. He's like, oh, that's my side piece. Yeah, yeah okay. Yeah. <laughs> We're starting on a bad foot here. All right, Leanna. <laughs> so we went out for dinner on her birthday. Aww. And Cute. Uh, look, I'm not the most romantic person. And she's very nice about it. She sometimes teases me. So I got her some jewelry, and I thought that. She would be surprised by that. And hey, I'm no offense to you, but I'm sure getting her anything would be very good if you're not used to, like, if you normally don't get her stuff. Totally. Yeah. So I knew she was going to be excited. Good. So we're at dinner, and right before dessert, they bring out this box. And so I hand her the box, and she opens it up mm -hmm. and takes out the ring. Oh, my God. You got it. Uh, Wait. Oh, it was so a you're ring. The jewelry you met? So you're proposing or you're not proposing? I don't understand. No, I'm not proposing. I'm not proposing. This is the point. That's why I'm here. Why would oh. you give it to a waiter to bring out a ring if you're not yeah, proposing? Bro. Showmanship. I, mean, <laughs> I thought, look, I thought if you don't get down on your knee, it's different. I thought, like, that was the thing. Kind of. Okay. Girl, just well, that, that, that's fair. Like, you weren't holding it up to her. They just brought it out and, like, gave it to her on a plate. Yeah, a plate in a box. He in said. a box. Yeah. Well, the box I'm assuming is on a plate. <laughs> but everybody around like sees it happening. Like she, oh, she no. opens it and freaks out. Yeah. And oh, she makes no. it like she like squeals. Yeah. And then like everybody started clapping. <laughs> yeah, I'd be the first one oh. to clap. Oh, oh, Did it no. look see that? like an engagement ring? Though? I don't think it matters. Like engagement yeah. rings can look like anything. It's a gesture. Yeah. I mean, I hope it would be a nicer ring if it was an engagement ring. <laughs> but like she's not a jeweler, so she doesn't know how much it costs. And she's sweet. <laughs> I mean, it is a green flag. She didn't care. Yeah, <laughs> she was like, All right. exactly. yeah. Very true. She loves you. No, yeah. So she said yes before you asked a question or what happened? Yes. She's like, oh, my God, of course. Yes, yes, yes. But she was like <laughs> surprised, but not like at least in that moment. Oh. Zero like hesitation. Uh, mixed feelings. Yeah. Okay. No. Oh, oh, dude. Sounds like you're getting married. I mean, I don't know that there's any way back. Well, yeah. I can only imagine what was going through your mind as this is all happening. What did you say? I was flabbergasted. I just, I've said very little. Oh, <laughs> you, didn't, no. you didn't get up and be like, actually, no, it's not an oh, engagement. My God. Oh, my God. Yeah. I didn't do that. Yeah. No. Really? <laughs> I didn't because I didn't have any time to process it. So you don't tell her anything. You just go along with it. Not that night, no. I not that night. You're probably processing. Like, okay. how do you say what something? Is, what does not do. that night mean? Well, the next morning. I tried the next morning. Okay, so we're oh. breakfast. And it's not never going to be a good time, but I'm like, this is as good a time as any. 
Okay. So I tell her, I'm like, that ring wasn't really a, a proposal ring. Oh. Is it bad I'm relieved we don't have to do this over the phone? Oh. <laughs> That's what I thought he was calling for. Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad it's done. Oh, my God. What so was you're her... sitting at the table. What does she do? Well, because I, I don't know, I guess because I laughed a little bit, she thought I was joking. Oh. <laughs> oh no. So wait, do you want to marry her? Oh, man. I don't know. Uh, oh. Um, oh, that is not a good response. I, like, it's been two years. Yeah. I don't know. Is she the one? Maybe. Like, am I ready? I don't know. I don't know. Oh. Like, am I supposed to know? Because yeah. Yeah. I definitely don't have for sure feelings. But like. That's not good. I don't know if I ever would be. Yeah. Well, yeah. then it's good that you're addressing it. And you're not just going to accidentally get married and so, keep playing along with this. How are we helping? Well, I mean, you give me some advice on how I can, on, on a good way to break it to her so that she's A, going to take it seriously. Oh, yeah, so she doesn't oh, think so it's another joke. It. Oh. Well, we're not <laughs> you, doing oh. anything. <laughs> you're right. We're you're just right. dialing the it. number. Oh, good point. JK oh, still has God. to do the talking in the awkward. I am so stressed We just out. need to oh. help him deliver the message so it doesn't come you know across what? as another joke. I think we should just let Alexis do this. It sounds like she's primed and ready yeah. for this. <laughs> uh, I think I'm going to hang up for us. <laughs> <laughs> you quit. Never mind. Oh, God. Keep her in the room. This is tough. Yeah, this is. Well, Brooke, is it better or worse that she thinks he joked about it oh. the first time he tried to <laughs> tell the truth? I mean, at least he's brought it up before, you know? Like, like it's, it's, it's not like it's an idea that you haven't put on the table. Mm-hmm. Actually, I brought it up more than once. You like, did? Oh. What? Yeah, I tried it again another time in the car, but oh. I don't know. Now it's a running joke. She thinks it's an oh. inside joke. It's one of those jokes that gets funnier the more yeah. that you say it. Yeah, or you think she like, knows, but she's just ignoring him at this point. Yeah. <laughs> she's like, yeah, like, oh, you're married. Yeah. <laughs> They're going to get to their golden uh, anniversary, and he's still going to be like, by the way, I, I swear <laughs> I never meant to propose to you. I have another family. <laughs> <laughs> Good one. Oh, JK, you've been so funny. Oh, God. <laughs> oh no. Wow. But you want to stay with her, right? We don't want to break the relationship up? No, absolutely not. Oh, I definitely okay. do want to stay with her. Oh. Okay. Just want to take a step back. Oh, man. This sounds like an easy one. We're going to come back, <laughs> yeah. do an awkward Tuesday phone call to your, quote, fiancé, oh. and try to tell her for the third time that you never actually meant to propose to Maybe her. Maybe even fifth. It's kind of yeah. Like. <laughs> yeah. We'll do it with your awkward Tuesday phone call right Thank after you. this. Hold on. It's awkward. It's Tuesday. It's awkward Tuesday phone call. Telling your fiance you did not mean to propose to her over breakfast? Uh huh. That's strike one. Uh oh. Try telling her again in the car? Strike two. Oh, that's why there's baseball music. <laughs> now okay. we're hoping that telling her uh-huh. over the radio with millions of people listening won't be strike three uh, for our listener, JK, who uh-huh. accidentally popped the question to his girlfriend when he handed uh-huh. her a ring at her birthday dinner. It no, really was an accident. Actually, the waiter brought the ring to the table, which made it even yep. worse. Yeah. yeah. So she took that as a proposal, <laughs> understandably yeah. why, we and said, yes, of course I'll marry you. So JK just went along with it. Yeah. And his two attempts to backtrack clearly have not worked. That's why he's hoping we have some advice to finally get the message through to her oh, on this awkward Tuesday call. Jose, what do you think he should do? You need to be direct, bro. That's been your yeah. problem, I've noticed. You always laugh, you say, after, and it's kind of a upbeat situation. And that's why she doesn't believe you. Well, I don't want it to be doom and gloom. Mm. I think you direct. jump into that doom and gloom. Have you tried crying? Oh, oh. bro. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even think of that. Can you do that on command? I mean, I could probably make it sound like it. Oh. No, she would see through it. She would see through it for sure. Okay. She knows you. Yeah. I don't mean to be the doom and gloom person right now. But, but you somehow s- you're going to pull it off. Here we go. <laughs> Listen, you are just in very different places in your relationship right now. She's ready, obviously, to get married. You don't even know if you want to. Yeah. Like, I hadn't thought about Is this it. maybe a sign... That we call it. Oh, it's a oh, that we go. That's oh, no way. Doom and gloom. I just Stop saying. smiling when you say that. <laughs> She's not Why are smiling. you smiling? The doomiest the gloomiest you could be right I now. Know, <laughs> but it's heck? like, what if like six years go by and you still aren't sure and then you've wasted all of her time She's because upset. that's what obviously what she wants. Yeah. Like, I mean, well, hopefully, look, I'm trying to avoid this kind of like predicting what happens with the rest of our lives. Yeah. In this moment, so I'm just like, I'm trying to make it not such a heavy thing. Right, and besides, that's for a different segment that we're going to be doing coming up called Brooke Breaks Up Your Relationship. Oh. <laughs> I would 
love that. Honestly, dude. some people really need it. I have yeah. so many girlfriends that were in relationships for way too That's long. That's great. That I, I bet, wish yeah. I would have called. If you want and just quality made it couples counseling, reach yeah. out to Brooke. <laughs> Most of my advice will be you're wasting your time. Move on. That's yeah. great. Yeah. Okay. So everybody is. We're, we're running out of time here, so we got to call Leanna and right. try to deliver the news that the proposal was not done on purpose. JK, hopefully our advice helped yeah. you a little bit. We'll jump in if we feel like you need a little bit of help. But here we go. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Hello? Uh, hey, honey. Hello? Oh, hi. <laughs> oh, my God. I was, I was actually just talking about you. Oh, um, like what? Like to your boss or something or? No, uh, I was just talking to one of my coworkers. She she saw the ring, of course. So I told her a story. Oh, wow. Uh, cool. <laughs> you okay? Um, are you are you in like a private area or or if you're not, if you're like area. maybe move to a private area so just we can talk for. Uh, um. Okay. Um. Just hang on a second. Okay. My uh. My door's closed. Okay. So. Uh. Um. So it feels like there's. I don't know. It's like there's never a good time to have this type of conversation. Um. Uh. Oh. Um. Okay. What's Okay, what's wrong? Because I'm getting like nervous. Okay, so you know how like the last week or so, there were times where I was joking about us not being engaged or about me not meaning it. <laughs> like at the like house. Like in the car? And then, yeah, and in the car. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. Because even though... Even though those came across as jokes, I was not, I was trying to tell you the truth. The truth. What do you, what do you, what do you mean the, the truth? The truth that, like, babe, when we were at the restaurant and I wanted to get you something nice mm. for your birthday and you, you kind of took it another way and, and then that spiraled. Um. So I just kind of went with it because I didn't know what to do and I was like, I was blindsided by it because I hadn't not something I had considered, and now what it's just like you, out okay, of control. Okay, but what are you what are you saying though? Well, I guess what I'm saying, is, okay, it, like you deserve better than to being accidentally proposed to. Well, actually, okay, so that's why you need to hear the truth. Uh -oh. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, so um, we're so we're not engaged. I mean, I just, I really didn't, I definitely didn't mean to propose to you. <sighs> so, I mean, I guess not. You, you didn't mean to propose to me. Are you serious? Yeah. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Snake. The Lord! Oh my God, I'm not engaged. What? what? I'm Wait, not engaged. Hold on. <laughs> what the heck? Is that Joy? <laughs> I, I'm not uh, sure what's going on. Uh, hello? How are we the confused ones? Hello? Hello. Hey, Leanna. Hey. You're on the radio right now. We're a show called Brooke and Jeffrey in the morning. We were... We were helping JK make this call to you. Yeah, because he was mm -hmm. super... Uh, you're so worried. I thought this was a private conversation. Yeah, sorry. This is called oh, an awkward sorry, Tuesday yeah. phone call. Because <laughs> JK so did, he didn't know how to deliver the news to you that that proposal was not meant as a proposal. Mm -hmm. Did you but, did you shout thank the Lord when he said that? <laughs> I think thank God. Thank um, Lord. Baby, what's going on right now? <laughs> <laughs> Did you not want to be I, engaged? I just like it was a high pressure situation, and I don't not love you. He feels the but, same. 
I wasn't like ready for this yet. Oh my god! Oh, it's perfect. You guys are actually on the same <laughs> wow. page. Wow! You accidentally are on the same page after accidentally getting engaged. Yeah. <laughs> what the heck? So then, why did you pretend? Is it, were you pretending, or was I just misreading your enthusiasm? Yeah. No, it was my birthday, and like <laughs> I didn't want to ruin it, and oh. you never get me stuff like that. So I know. I don't know. <laughs> His voice just cracked. I think we're all confused too because it oh. sounded like you were really thrilled and the whole restaurant was thrilled and you went home and you told your parents and they were all thrilled. Oh my god, it's oh, so yeah. amazing. Yeah. Well, like actually my my mom wasn't thrilled about oh. the engagement. Oh. oh really? <laughs> really? Why is that? What did she say? She thought it was like kind of just like a short-term thing. Oh. oh. Wait. You guys oh. you guys have been together for 2 years. Yeah, but like you never like Ask my dad or like oh, talk yeah. to my mom about it oh. or talk to my friends about it. Okay. So it's, like when I tell my mom this, she's going to be like over the moon. <laughs> Whoa. Wait, hold on. This is you, good news for everyone. You guys are broken up though. Like you're still together, right? <laughs> Why are the men so insulted? <laughs> yeah. I'm a little blindsided because there's no way in a million years that I would have expected this kind of enthusiastic <laughs> relief and, and this kind of reaction. Well, it's a good thing, brother. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to say I'm not going to pin you as one that was really dialed in with human emotion to begin yeah. with. Um, yeah. I mean, you did accidentally <laughs> propose by giving a girl a ring. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Maybe you next want- time, different piece of jewelry or no jewelry no, at all. This is what you learned. You don't buy your girl any more gifts. No. Remember, <laughs> the first time you do it, look what happens. That's why I never did it before, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> there you yeah, go. Just smart stick guy. with earrings or a necklace. Yeah, yeah. A necklace would have been great. And Leanna, you should probably give. Well, no, keep the ring, I guess. Yeah, keep the ring. Keep the ring. That's a normal ring. Yeah. But I guess by the power vested in us, we officially declare you <laughs> unengaged, right? Yay! This is where you ceremoniously move it from your left hand to your right hand. There we go. I just did. Oh, right. <laughs> I just did. Well, congratulations on your unengagement right here on Brooke and <laughs> Jeffrey wow. in the morning. Thank you. <laughs> I am... Um, so glad we're not getting married. Hundred oh. percent. Me too, baby. I love you. Oh. <laughs> this ended up so cute. <laughs> it's Brooke and Jeffrey in the morning.